Welcome Manga Chat viewers, a special episode of Manga Chat today. Here with Josh Pettinger. Say hello Josh. Be. How's it going? We're down at Staples. Uh, we've got our guru, organic yerba mate. We're off our fucking tits on this stuff. This shit is full of caffeine yerba. We, Josh, is, she's got the shakes. Yeah, yeah. So we're here at Staples. We, we've got the zine fair on Sunday, permanent damage here in Los Angeles. So we're here to print up uh, our new zine. So we're going to head on into the staples and, uh, and see how it goes. We haven't haven't printed a zine like this for a while, have we, Josh? No. no. Like basics. I feel like I'm 20 again. Uh, I'm going to put my beverage in the bin over here. But it's very Christmas here. They've got Christmas poles. All right, so staples. Let's see how this goes. I called them up and they told us that we could actually print our zine. Um, oh, they're hiring a part-time receptionist here at the Ocean Spa. If the, the zines fail, Josh, we can work here. With the price of paper going through the fucking roof. We're going to stop by LA Fitness and uh, do some spotting on the way back. Ugh. Get a big steak over at the Wood Ranch. Alright, here we are, kids. So we're going to show you how to do it. This is how you print a zine. Hopefully. Alright. Slip this camera around. How do I flip it? There we go. Alright, let's have a look. There's that self. Hey, how you doing? Pretty good. Just checking out your print shop over here. All right. Self-serve copying. Look at this. Work table. Let's let's check it out and figure it out. All right. Machine out of service. Yeah. Computer workstation. Printer. Um, all right. So this one's out. There. There's one over there. Might have to talk to the people, I guess. All right. Oh, let's figure it out. So what have we got? All right. Some people are saying this is better than... We've got our stick here. This better than the World Cup. Check up your library. This is the, the zine is on, on, on here. All right. Come prepared, we bought our own long arm stapler. Very nice. Okay. Yes. All right, I've got to think about paper. Um, yeah, thick paper. Yes, can we put thicker paper in the machine? We will have to talk to the, the, the copy people here, the experts, the textbooks. Yeah. Let's have a look at this machine here. Looks pretty good. It's a regular. Oh, they got A4 and they got like uh, European sizes on there. That's nice. Paper. Yeah, that feels. That's got a nice thickness to it. Yes, thicker than. Excuse me. Yes. I got a few questions. We need to print like a little book here. Okay. Yeah, we can run the machines ourselves. Can we put paper in? Can we open them and put paper? So we, we couldn't print a booklet over here? Um, they don't have the option for it, unfortunately. Okay, okay. We couldn't just do like double-sided sheets though, and like collate ourselves? You can do that. Because yeah, I've got my own stapler. Oh, yeah, well, yeah. What's the price difference? Like, what is a black and white copy per side on that machine? That machine, mm. if you're to do it out there, it's 23 cents per side. Oh. Now, our machines back here, though, are 30 cents per side. 30? So it is actually going to be a lot black, less expensive. Black and white? Yeah. Oh, that's expensive. So it's inflation? What's going on there? It is inflation, that's yeah, hardcore. unfortunately. Okay. Well, we could just do 50 copies. Yeah, what, what's that? Four, so it's 14 sides, so times three. So, yeah, we're looking at like three, three bucks something a, a unit. 23 times 
You pirates, you absolute pirates. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. For sure. 322. 322, so for 50, that's like 150, 150 bucks for like 50 copies. We need them for a zine fair on Sunday. Oh, yeah. You've got us over a barrel. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah, 61 the... bucks for 50 copies. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So probably over here we could do it. That yeah. would be the least expensive way to go, yeah. We just plug the stick in over there and figure it out on the computer. Oh, yeah. I'm yeah, like... it'll be the print mode to get, to get started, and then there's an option for USB. Okay. Do you think you can figure it out? Yeah, we have them <laughs> labeled like 1A, 1B, so that's like each side. Two oh, okay. A, two B, so, we... so it should be easy, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, well, is it each separate files, or is it all on one file? It's all separate files. Okay. Um, give me just a second. Okay. Because um, what I could do is I could combine them all into one file in order, and it's going to be a lot easier to print it out that way. Okay, yeah. yeah. If you think cool. it help us, that'd oh, yeah, be no great. Problem. I'll give you a tip or something at the nah, end. Nah, no worries. <laughs> Free elastic bands. Free elastic bands? My gosh. Okay, well, it's going to be a bit pricey, but it's all right, you know. Still seven bucks. Yes, yes. No, we'll still make a make a profit and uh, yeah, make yeah. it worth its time. We can do the rest at Mixam. I you see it? the Jones Zine. They said it's going to be here. Off. They said they're going to ship it today. Really? From the UK? Yeah. No, I still can't believe three days from the UK. Yeah, we'll have to yeah. see about that. We will see. Uh, uh, we have three, four, five days. Oh, so I guess we will uh, be collating ourselves. We can use this table and... Uh, do they have a slicer? They don't seem to have a slicer for the public. Uh, slicer back there. Oh, yeah, this one? Oh, yeah, okay. That's a bit small. It's just going to take a minute to merge it, and then you should be able to, and then I'll get back to you, and you'll have it all in one file. Thank you very much. No problem. Oh, it's down there. Okay. Yeah, let's see. I prefer the chicken. You can always go to, there's a fair bit of Kinko's across the road, you want to check out what they've got. We can, we can try another one that. Seven. Wait, that one? Oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, that's, that's one. Oh, there we go. I think it's over the table. Six and right. Oh, yeah, there we go. It's, uh, it's, it's right. folded over four ways and see yeah, how it does, how it deals with that. Okay, so slide to either end. Ooh, that's done quite well. Let's fold it over again, that'll be eight. Oh, uh, no, that's not done it. It's, that's only done half. Yeah. I don't know if it's going to do seven sheets. Um. Maybe this one? Yeah, we'll figure it out. Or we can get some metal rulers and use X-Acto blades and slash our fingers open. Uh, I've done that before many times in the past, in the in the 90s. Back in the 90s. Let's see if this one will do. Oh, yeah, here we go. Uh, here we go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's just called binder rule. It's called what? Binder 1. Binder 1? Mm -hmm. Alright, thank you very much. No problem. Did that cut that smoothly or? It did cut that smoothly, yeah. This this seems like the one. Yeah, yeah. Alright, we should be able to get away with that. Alright. Alright, it's a waiting game. Alright, Binder 1. You're our tech man, Josh, so you're gonna have to you're gonna have to figure this out. Yeah, very excited about this zine. Let's see. Tedward classic movies split zone. By Josh Pettinger and Simon Hanselman. Yeah, it's exciting for me to do something out of my out of my zone. Coming down to our level. Yeah, doing a <laughs> doing a romance comic with human characters. Yeah. It could have been an owl story though. Like writing Tedward, I did kind of write him as owl a little bit. Like that, that story could be swapped and yeah. I could just do it with owl. Uh, I mean, it could be it could be Mark Corrigan. It could be like anyone. Yeah, just a just a romantic old fashioned gentleman. Yeah. All right, down at the copy and print center. Could be that owl's brother spinoff. Yeah. Right. 
Oh, here we go. Look at this. The machine is free. Okay. All right. Got our stick here. It goes in here. All right, Josh, let's do it. Stick goes in there. Boom. Processing. Oh, oh, sorry, you're still using this? Yeah, I'm still using this. Oh, sorry. Uh, Thought you'd left. Oh, look at us, we're too excited. Sorry. Too excited. Okay. <coughs> what people saying? Don't know. Lamau, close one. Yeah, no, we we're almost onto the copier. Yeah, it's a shame we can't open it and put different paper in. Yeah, that's all right. Just you know, we can go more hardcore with the mix am one and do what we want paper wise. I'm happy with just all white. You know. Good for permanent damage. Yeah. Have you finished now? Uh, no. It's rebooting. The, the oh, rebooting. Yeah. Okay. How, how much longer do you think you'll be? No rush. Just, just. Well, the machine's gonna take about five minutes to reboot, and whatever time she's gonna take. And then I'm printing four sets of sixteen pages. Okay. Sorry. It's all right. You got here first. We'll wait patiently. Well, we could go to FedEx Kinko. Should I run and ask how much it is? How far is it? Oh, you can't run over there. Yeah. Let's just drive over. Yeah. Let's just drive over and get a price quote. I could Google that. Yeah, I guess. If they have it on their website. Oh, the life of a zine stuff. Yeah, four times 16 double size. That would take a while with rebooting machines and if there's any more technical problems. Got a machine on the service here. Might be better trying the FedEx Kinkos. I say we just roll over there. Let's do it. Well, that's saying, uh, fifty company one side or both sides. Yeah. 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 Or do it yourself. Forty nine cents a page. Forty nine cents a page. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Jesus. Fucking yeah. Christ. I'm used to photocopies being like eight to ten cents. Or like in Melbourne at Sticky Institute, I used to get them for two cents a side. Okay. Two cents a side, black and white, ten cents color, I think, maybe 20 or 30, but gosh, it was affordable. My golly gosh. Fifty cents. Oh, Seven dollars. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I remember printing at Ryman's in the UK. Remember Ryman's? Yeah, yeah. I used to go down there. I used to do these Megan Mog zines in like two thousand nine, and it was nine pounds per unit for like a forty-page zine. I was printing them full color. That's why they were so expensive. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, nine pounds a zine. So it wasn't making much of a profit on those. Well, I guess it's not worth it going to FedEx then. But more, more affordable over here. Here's someone saying, why not just buy a printer and do it at home at this point? Well, well we don't want it on a home printer. We want Xerox. We want classic old school Xerox, not, yeah. not home printer. That's, that's for, you know. There's too many home printed books out there. Yeah, Frank Santoro would have our guts for garters. And when I printed uh, yeah, at home, your lines were all like, lost because there was... So thin. Yeah, I've got thin spidery lines, so we, we, we can't be working on a home printer. We need professional uh, hot Xerox, yeah. hard, hot toner. What do you guys are trying to print? Uh, booklet, 28 page uh, small black and white booklet. You know, got all our files sorted. So we were gonna like staple and trim it ourselves. Yeah, we'll collate here on the table. Got my own long arm stapler. I'll just come back later. Yeah, okay, so they can go ahead. 
Are okay. you sure? Go ahead. <laughs> Isn't that sort of like quantum? So it says 10 to 15. Yeah, I'll, I'll come okay. back later. So there's no sort of like a quantity based discount or anything. It's always just 23 cents a page. Yes, yes, 23 cents. If you do behind the counter, but you're looking at like in the yeah. thousands to get this, start going, going down in price. Yeah, yeah. Or yeah, hundreds, yeah. It, goes, it goes down like if you do a couple hundred, it, it drops maybe a penny. And you go do you know, thousands, it drops another penny, and yeah. so on and so on. Yep. Okay. Looks like it's actually ready. It's ready? Yeah. Oh, she's left. Oh, I'll come back later. No, <laughs> she's gone. All right, well, thanks for your help. You're welcome. All right, let's do it, Josh. Let me get the old... Uh, let me get the thing. He's still alive. Yeah, yeah. Let me get the stick. All right, let's try and do this. Show through the black. Oh, yeah, how's it looking there? Is that the That looks nice. This is, this is cool. This is nice. This is nice printing. Tech computer man. Computer man. Copy or print? Co print. P print? Uh, yeah, yeah, I think so. Temporary pre authorization. Right. Technical issue. Retry. We might have to pay these uh, exorbitant FedEx prices. Bloody machines. Tap to get started. Printing from a USB. I think we're going to have to go to FedEx, maybe. There might be another Staples in the area, actually. Um, yeah, you check. I've got, got my phone running. Printing. USB. Over the charge for the final You approve the transaction. Okay, got it. Where's the nearest other samples? By the way, it's in the edge. Yeah, no, this is this ain't working. Ay, 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 ay. The UPS store, let's see how much it is down. UPS has software stuff. Yeah, I think we're out of luck. No, technical issue. All right, let, let, let's roll. Uh, this machine's not working. Get the stick. Yeah, I think we'll have to try another Staples maybe. There's a few oh. more locally out there. Yeah, for sure, man. Yeah, it seems. Uh, the other guy said it was going to be 15 minutes maybe until it oh. rebooted and it oh, just it just keeps on saying it's. Uh, oh. Just copy the right one. Oh, we're we copying, not printing? No, it would be print. It would be print. Let me see if there's something. I think there's like two other staples in the area, aren't there? Or are you all like rival staples? Do you hate the other staples? Oh no, we're all together. <laughs> desperate to keep us here. Don't go to the other staples, my commission. No, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with the other one over there? Oh, I gotta replace the drum on that. Yeah. They are fickle machines. Yeah. Mm. What about this printer? Wow. That printer? It's like a home printer. Can we take it there? Can we print on that thing over there? Unfortunately, that's how we hook up the computer. Right. Fax them, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, print a zine on fax, fax machine. I don't know if that's ever been done before. Edward Teletext. Yeah, the line work may be a bit diminished. <laughs> What do you think's wrong with it? You got any any suspicions? Was it not reading like was it saying that when you were putting your USB drive in? Yeah, it just kept saying like error. Oh. Yeah. Okay. The only thing is I don't know what it is. Um there's some there's certain flash drives it doesn't like. Right. Scan disk is usually the most popular one, but there's some that we don't know like and we actually don't know why it won't read because yeah. I was able to pull up each file like no problem back there. Okay. So. Uh, there was an error for the lady who was here before as well. So I think it's an error. Yeah. Mm. But there is an option for email. Print from email. There. Yeah, there is. You have all the files in your You have the files in your email. I've got most of them. Yeah. Yeah. Can we email you the files? Or? Well, the thing is, um, let me actually. I could email it from there. Because okay. it'll email us a PDF. Hmm. So let me go ahead and do that and see if we pull it up. Do you want the stick again? Oh no, we got the file got right it. there, so let me go ahead and send it over. Okay, well thanks for your help. Oh yeah, no problem. Yeah, could be the stick. Might, might not like Jack's weird library stick in yeah. a pen, that stick in a pen. I'm not the patience to stick with this. You were? Yeah, people are still watching. Yeah, it's as many. Oh, really? Yeah. This is going to be the most patience testing, like how to print a zine video on YouTube. <laughs> it certainly is. Yeah, it could require some editing. We're not about that. We don't do any editing on Manga Chat. This is realistic. This is what it's really like. It's raw. Yeah, yeah. yeah this, is, this is real life. Yeah, last minute zine printing. $10 off custom banners. Oh, yeah. Well, how much is a custom banner? Oh, imagine getting one of those free standing ones. Something trying to zhuzh up the uh, the stand at the fair, you know, you got to get noticed yeah. and get daddy to pay for it. Oh, what are we going to do when we print it with mix sound? We're going to keep it little, or yeah, they have a, the digest size is eight and a half by five and a half, and they'll trim it and do like the we yeah. get a full bleed, yeah. yeah, yeah. Can't stand the idea of having that border. You know. yeah, it works for bubbles to have like all the, the dodgy corners and like messy edges and not printing to the edge. But you know, it's it's a zine that you read. It's not comics. Yeah. Did you ever do that in the past? That like you get a metal ruler and then you run an exacto blade down the, the side of the book so you can trim all the pages and make them all even. No, and no. then you'll slip and like. Ah! No, I think I've only. Uh a couple of things like that but I never did that it's it's not advisable I think Grant and I did it once with like 60 page scenes yeah. with French flaps so you'd be really careful not to slash the French flap fold and it was yeah you, you're doing like 20 passes basically doing like a sheet at a time it's just yeah. keep sharpening your blade it's it's, it's a rough one I, I never want to do that ever again <laughs> it's so brutal but then, you know, it's hard to get a home slicer that will cut through, yeah, seven, yeah. eight, nine, ten sheets. Uh. I was doing that for this book, um, for the Tether thing, it was like, uh, so I had all these blank pieces of Bristol board, but they were like bigger than 11 by 17, so yeah. I was doing a big ruler and exacto knife in, but it just, the ruler just kept moving, so I just kept accidentally slicing. Yeah, it's really hard panels. to keep the, the, yeah, you're lucky you didn't slash your fingers yeah, yeah. off. But I just do it with scissors, I trimmed a bunch of paper for the Tedwood thing, I just... And just, you know, under a lamp, carefully do it with the scissors. Yeah. It's straight enough. Yeah, you rule the line and then dig deep. I don't like working with exacto knives. No. It's too, too visceral, too medieval. You need like a laser that you can... James Bond laser. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Stuff in the talk. No, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die. 
It's one of those things I've never actually seen that. I've just seen a. Uh, is it Hank Scorpio? Yeah. Like yeah. Thing. Should be able to pull it up. Is this my chemical romance player? Yeah. Giraffe. He's a comics man. He's got a good soundtrack to try to print a comic. Uh, let's see if this works. That's actually a machine. Okay. All right. We're gonna hit up another staple set. All right. Yeah. Sorry about that, man. No, no stress. Thanks for all your help. Oh yeah, uh, no problem. Yeah, you've been a dream. Oh yeah, no problem guys. Good luck with these naughty machines. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Have a good one. I think we've got everything, got our stick, stapler. Alright. Cheers problem. mate. No problem. Alright, let's go and Google up another staples. That's such a shame about the FedEx prices. That's mental for black and white copies. 50 cents. Like, fuck off. Fucking mental. All oh, right, out in the wastelands of America, the barren wastelands. No, I don't think so. I think I gave it back to you. Ugh, barren fucking wasteland. Smoke them if you got them. All right, well, may as well shut this down then. And uh, to be continued, thank you, loyal Manga Chat viewers, for watching us deal with the technical difficulties. We're going to head to a different Staples, and we'll be back. And we're going to be trying to print this fucking Tedwood split zine, which will be available at Permanent Damage on Wednesday. When's Permanent Damage, Josh? December 4th. December 4th. That's Sunday, December 4th. I'll be there from 12 till 5. The event, I believe, goes from 12 till 10. But I've got a child, so I'll be fucking off at 5 o'clock to get home to do my fatherly duties. I don't have time to hang around and watch a bunch of bands. I'm not a fucking young man. All right. We're going to feck off, Josh will finish his fag, and we're going to get off down to the fucking other staples. Hope you're all having a nice day, and uh, we'll see you again in a bit. Cracking. We are at FedEx Kinko's, what is it, 13 cents? 17 cents aside. 17 cents. Yeah, so oh, yeah, the yeah, website's yeah. at 43 or something, which is outrageous. 49. But... 49, that's, yeah, but no, very helpful here. Uh, we've, bought our, we've bought our Hammer Mill Premium Razor Print Paper. Got the stick. All right, Josh, um, you're our computer man. Let's figure this out. Select service to begin. Make copies. Wait, wouldn't it just be print? Yeah. Wouldn't it just be print? Like well, we are making copies. So I'm confused by the, 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 the language behind all this. Well, print one first if you just do print. All right. Yeah, I mean, After that, you just put it in. Mm. Authorised payment. Alright, I'll do that. Yeah. Well, you know when you get that code? Or if it's hey, the issue, just call the Alright, please remove cards. Oh boy, it's Mickey! It's my Mickey card, though. Right, clicking I accept or access any part of FedEx online servers, you acknowledge you've read and blah 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 yeah, well, they yeah. kept them on file. The other place, I was like, he was like, no, no, I've got all your files on. on. It's like you've kept our files. This one, right? Yeah, I think. But don't we just want to do one test one, or well, I don't know if you're confident. Should we do like a test? Or do you want to do some test sheet? See how the lines come out. Yes, yes. Let's try and do a test sheet. So we're being automatically charged. So if we if we fuck it up, then we have to pay. Some okay. Total copies one. Yeah, do it. Next. Total print job. What? One. Oh, color. That's color. No, 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 no. We want black and white. Please, please wait. Mm. Thirty-four cents. Wait, I thought he said it was thirteen cents per side. This. Total copies one. Paper size eleven by seventeen. That's that's, that's, that's yeah. Letter. Is that the one? Mm -hmm. Ah, that looks good. There we go. Seventeen cents. Beautiful. Plus tax, 18 cents. We're gonna get reamed on tax. America! 
How much was the tax? Three cents? One cent. Oh, so 18 cents. Let's see how this looks. Smell that toner. Oh. Looks good. Oh, I smell that toner. Yeah. yeah, we definitely need the new paper because it bleeds like crazy. Yes, it's a bit bleedy. I, I don't mind the bleed, friend. There's a preview here. Then you got me doing Tedwood, you got Josh doing Tedwood, as you've seen before. This looks good. Okay. Um, Alright, so we've got to crack our paper here. Insert a card. Load paper. Very nice. So, we're going to cut these on, on your guys' paper. Oh, yeah. You can go ahead and take it out. Do. So, we'll do get a slight bit of bleed through on there. So what we'll do is we'll just take this stuff out. Alright. Then you can just put your ring in here, which one to do. Watch those corners. Yeah, I'll probably just take about half of that at the moment. Oh, just about half? Yeah, it can't fit the whole thing. It goes right to the line there. Ah. No, they're nice. If we're doing that double-sided, is it easier to put the PDF or separate sheets? We have both separate sheets and the PDF on the drive. Well, if we're doing that, uh, well, yeah. if we're doing uh, double-sided, it should have give you the option here. But let's go to do more work, right? I know it's pretty better. PDF at the bottom down there. This one here. Yeah, so you want to do these double-sided, right? Yeah. So yeah, you just go to here. Make sure you select black and white. Yeah. And just so that, because um, we want to print off that paper, just leave these open. Uh -huh. it, sort of, it sort of forces the machine to take it out of this one. Okay, control. okay. So or you could even just go, I mean, it's going to it's gonna print by 8.5 by 11. Yeah. You already have it set on that anyways. It says one sided there, we want two sided, don't we? Yep. Yeah. Two sided flip one. Should we no, wait, wrong one. one. Oops. That's that one. Yeah, it's going to go like that. Because you can always preview it before you commit to printing it. Okay. So that's what it's going to look like when it prints out. Okay. So yeah, it looks like we have everything set here. That looks correct. And um, how many copies did you want? Um, Should we do one first to make sure it all works and then... Oh yeah, that's that's the best way to do yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I'll do, do a, one first. Do a test one. Yeah, so let's go sure next. The pages are all in order and everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hi there. Hi. That's how much you're basically going to charge you for sex. Do I have to print? 261 a unit, it's not bad. Uh -huh. Okay, not so bad. The, and that'll just print out the thing? Just yep. hit print? Yep, just go ahead and click print. Whoa. Oh. Just make sure everything works okay here. Gambling two dollars sixty on this. Mm -hmm. Oof. Okay. Anyway, it adds up, especially yeah. if you're gonna make like thirty like stacks of it. Well, yeah. Well, it doesn't yeah, seem yeah. like much at first, but then it's like, oh yeah. Well, two sixty a unit price is not bad. If we do it online and get it shipped, it can, we can get it down like a dollar a unit. But we need them quick for a, a fair on the weekend, like a little comic book fair. Oh yeah. Pay a bit extra and get them. Oh, let's wait for this thing to do its thing. Yeah. The magic. Please wait. Yeah, sometimes it's got a thing. Just give it a few minutes here. I'm just gonna help out. Yeah, no worries. Thank you very much. Can you just drop it off? Yes. And I didn't print it. I have it on my phone. Okay, so what you'll have to do is yeah, lime mode looks very nice. Yeah. So black as well. Yeah, no, it's a nice, uh, it's a nice thick toner. What's this insert a card? That mean? You know, it's doing its job. The computer is, uh, it's thinking. There's a shot of the we're waiting. Please wait. Josh is browsing the door cells and the lightning cables. Got some business books over here. Look at that. Leadership reinvented. 
Should check some of this stuff out for our business. Oh, here we go. Documents sent to printer. Oh my gosh, it's happening. It's all happening. Oh my gosh. What's that? We'll make a logo. Yeah, we've got the stapler here. Now we'll do it. I'll try on the trimmer as well. Are you looking good, yeah. Yes. A nice intuitive machine. Oh, where's the thing? You're going to set it up and get like a little bit of that. Oh, thank you. Oh, my gosh. Magic. All right. So we've got the stapler here. Oh, this is neat. All right. Are we staple and trim or trim and staple? Uh, I think staple because then it keeps mm -hmm. it all solid, you know, because it's not going to move or, or anything. Nice yeah, it's yeah, blaze. It's it's oily, oily book. Oh, God, it felt good. God, it's been a while since I've stapled a book. Oh, yeah. All right. Green staples. We don't really like those. We could always buy some other staples. Is that staple working for you guys? Yeah, I bought my own long arm stapler. So she's working like a dream, purring like a kitten. Alright, whoa, this is seven sheets of thick paper. I don't know if this is going to actually work. Nate's in the chat. Nate's in the chat. Both wearing Nate's in the shirt. Oh, that's done. That's beautiful. That's, that's, that's perfection. Oh, God. It's going to be easier than I thought. This feels so good. God. Oh, my gosh. It's full bleed. Oh, that's beautiful. This is, this is, I'm having the time of my life. God, I feel alive. <laughs> oh. Yep. Let me sure we didn't cut anything off. No, it all looks good. Borders all look great. Not like Nate's scenes, where Nate prints those <laughs> crappy zines. You know, Nate Garcia's zines, where all the, all the sides get cut off and you can't, you can't read all the jokes. No, this is a, this is a well-trimmed booklet. Give it a nice fold here. Someone left this on the table. Maybe we can use that to print some extra. Oh, beautiful. Oh, fuck. Look at that. Look at that. There it is. It's trimmed a bit bit off over there. But... Can you do a last, like, trim just to make sure it's all easy? Well, I don't know. This is 14 sheets, so I don't know if it's going to do... Well, ideally, that's what we would want, but... Nah, no way. No, that's just that's just that's going off track. That's it. Yeah, this is fine though. I think this this will this will suffice. This one's ruined now. Uh, this one can be Nate's copy. Okay, I think we're good. So it, it, it trims up well enough. And, uh, oh, that is nice. Yeah. Although this, the black is so nice. It's nice. We should do all of our printing here at the sure FedEx Kinkos. All in the right order. Yes, yes. Double check quality control. Josh is on the quality control. I need to shave, I look terrible. Same. What, what a couple of scumbags down at the old FedEx. I stink as well, I'm in a shower. I washed my pits down with a wet wipe uh, before we came here. I feel bad for the attendants because I, I can smell my own body odor. Yeah? So much nicer than I thought it was gonna be. That's, that's nice. Yeah. It's a shame we can't do a proper 14 trim, but it's, it's a little bit peeking out. It's okay. This is a limited edition thing just for permanent damage on Sunday. You can pick these up. You got a big long Pettinger story. You got a big long Hanselman Tedwood story. A bunch of no spoilers. All right, let's print them up. Let's do like 60 of them, yeah? Yeah. All right, you confident you can run the machine? Oh, transaction completed. No, we're not done yet. I guess we have to remove the design. Okay, so what was it? Print, was it? That's a shame, it's reset our settings. I guess payment in now. Yep. Oh boy, it's Mickey. Um, 
We don't have enough paper in there. For six it'll days. it'll stop and it'll ask for more paper uh, when when it when it wants it. Please insert more paper. Like a Dalek. Generating document preview. Oh, here's your yeah, I'm, I'm happy with this. Yeah, yeah. So, it's a shame we can't get the full trim, but uh, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if it was like that, that would be perfect, but we don't live in a perfect world. I wish we did, Josh, but we don't. Two sided. What did you know which one he chose? Um. Two sided flip on long edge, maybe? What does that look like? Should we wait for him again? We can probably still let, we can probably just say okay and then, like, if it looks weird. It's kind of a I'm gonna have to try to make sure it Two sided flip. He did a different, he changed it, didn't he? Yeah, yeah, that, that looks good. But they were horizontal when he did it, so there's something. Yes, yeah, so it's. It must be the short edge. Yeah, that's it, that's it. Okay. It's going to be exactly the same, isn't it? Yeah, it looks good. Yep, yeah, that was it. Total copies. 60? Wait, we have the math to make sure we have enough paper. 60. What was it? 60 times 7. Yeah, 6 7s. Turn one, yeah, 420 or something like that. It's more rough, man. 60 times 7. 420, bang, 420, bro. Blazing it. Hashtag blaze like me, let's get blazed. Am I doing copies of books or copies of sheets now? We might need the man's assistance, but there is quite a queue over there. We need an adult to help us. Yes, we do need the help of an adult man. I'm assuming copies it means the project, but we, we, we will need to clarify. If we print the PDF, it might be copies of the PDF. Yeah, so that's what I'm assuming, copies of the PDF slash booklet, but it could be, you know, copies of each page. You could, yeah. Beautiful scene, look at this. <coughs> Confirmed. 60 then. 60. Okay. Yeah? Do you think that's correct? He didn't want to come over. He's not his friend, but he's had a go, is he? Okay. What do you think? Should we do it? You can always, if it's not doing it properly, you can always like abort the job, mm -hmm. maybe. What do you think? Should we do it? I think so. You think it's set up? How do you feel? <laughs> He's scared. Yeah, I mean, I'm scared they're going to be like, no, it has to finish the job. And it's wrong. Yeah, yeah. Maybe we should wait for the friendly guy. Yeah, it'll continue. I'm going to go outside Have a cigarette. Alright, I'll keep an eye out. And, uh, the live stream entertaining. Yeah, yeah, of course. Let's have regular staples here. Right. Total copy 60, all pages, black and white. Two sided flip by short edge. Page size. Gosh, this looks good.
Josh has just abandoned the project. Oh. Almost free over there. Yeah. We'll learn from the price. What? We'll learn from the price. From the price? Yeah. What price? It's the price that it says when we click next. When we click next? Oh, really? Yeah, it'll tell us how much. Oh, all right. Current job cost is 156.37. That sounds right. Okay, I'm just going to do it then. Mm -hmm. End session. What? Oh, we need to do a, we need to do a couple of jobs. Wait, hang on. S customer safety transactions are limited to 80. What? Yes, we need to do eighty dollars worth and another eighty dollars worth. Another eighty dollars worth. But the the current cost is one fifty six. So I mean, if we split that up, just, we can we we'll do thirty copies and then thirty copies. Yeah, if we go back and then. Okay, total copies. Thirty. Okay. Yes. Oh, color? No, 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 no. Black and white. Black and white, all pages, two sided flip, one short, page to close. Yep, that's it. Alright, next. 78, yep. Price, that's in count 420. Yeah? Seems it. Alright, I'll put some print. Okay, let's check them as they come out. <clears throat> it's nice how it collates them all automatically. I used to, I mean, yeah, we both thought we were going to be sitting around like taking sheets and building the books. Yeah. I don't mind. I like collating and stapling. I miss it, you know. I felt like a traitor when I started going to Saigon in Seattle and like, getting someone else to print my books and trim them and staple them for me. That the magic was lost. What's that Seinfeld with the crap man, the old man? Like, that's what puts the magic in Magic Man. Each crap is rolled by a mantle bomb. That's what puts the magic in Magic Man. So I've always, you know, felt like that, taking it to heart. And I like to roll each crap myself. Yeah. yeah. Great soundtracks. Yeah. My Chemical Romance over at the thing. Got the, the Cranberries? The Cranberries, it certainly is. Dolores Alderidon. R.I.P. What are people saying? Are they entertained? I doubt it. I highly, highly doubt it. I don't know why anyone would watch this. There's, there's 42 sickos watching this right now. You're sick people. You get a life. Here we go, here we go. Where is it? Like, like, like vultures. Well, I guess that is the gun. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's, it's literally perfect. Just using the green staples. Yeah, whatever. Nice touch. Hand colored. I hand dyed them. This is just an ash can run. You know? This is an exclusive. Proper printing coming later. Oh, I just noticed an error on mine. What? An error? Where? There's a brick like thing in black, which I didn't mean 
Oh gosh, we'll fix it for the for the professionally printed one. But yeah, this is a uh, this is good over here. I, I might print more zines over here. This is this has been a pretty decent experience at the FedEx. Staples was dodgy as heck. Or busted machines. So that that ponytail man is really nice. So he was very helpful. But yeah, FedEx certainly has better machines. Oh man, back in the back in the saddle, saddle, saddle stitch. Ah, bit of zine humor there, bit of wordplay. Did you get that? Pick up on that one? Yeah, yeah. Pretty yeah. good. Yeah, we've uh, we've managed it. We're going to get this done in a decent amount of time, I think. Go get some lunch after this. Go to Chuck E. Cheese or something. Get a pizza. Mm -hmm. Check out the animatronics. Play with ski ball. I actually really, yeah. <laughs> really funny to go to Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> and I'm drawing that Chuck E. Cheese scene in my comic right now. So it'd actually be good to go and research. But I don't know if they'd have vegan cheese. You could Google that. Uh, vegan cheese, Chuck E. Cheese, Charles Entertainment Cheese. I'm assuming that is here the rat's full name, Charles Entertainment Cheese. Yeah, I think so. the, the E must stand for entertainment, surely. It's one of those things now where I can't remember if I heard that before or if I heard it from music. Yeah, I probably stole it from Twitter or something. Like most of my jokes are just stolen from people on Twitter, like Shia LaBeouf stealing things from Dan Clowes, so I just assume no one will ever catch me. I haven't had an original idea since 1997. I was trying to remember where I, uh, Bobby Fettuccini. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? What's Bobby Fettuccini? I don't know, Robert Oh yeah, Robert Fettuccini. Yeah, I think I saw that somewhere online, maybe. Yeah, that's... That's very funny. Robert Fettuccini. I wish that was canon. What's that? What's that beeping sound? Transaction completed. Please remove the USB drive. We're not done yet. I'm gonna have to take it out. I just have to reset it up. I, I can't live with that beeping. That uh, drive me mental. Got the telltale heart, you know. It's just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop the beating of the heart. I made a claymation adaptation of that for a college. Really? Yeah. Is there any way to view this? No. One dollar. They probably didn't have Vimeo back then, did they? Yeah, I am getting hungry. You getting hungry? No, that cheese toasty and salad was more than enough for me. I just had a small uh, tomato cheese pastry and a coffee for breakfast. It's like Nate's here is just uh, discussing breakfast. Yeah, I'll only need to eat something at some point. I figure I could have some garbage, we like I'm a chicken or something. I get some Donnie's on the way home, really slumming up and just eat some trash. Yeah. yeah, completely sober, horribly sober. It's all the driving I've had to do this morning. Oof, disgustingly sober. It's, oh, it's horrible. It feels so clear and fresh, it's awful. Yeah, I saw you got that in there. I was very happy that they've got the trifecta. We've got to do some newsprint anthology zines at some point. Or just yeah. here, just print them here. Just, just I, I want to do some sloppy zines. Like just, you know, in the middle of our other projects, buff out some real slop jock, you know, crappy work. Not crappy, but you know, some sloppy work. You know, like you and Jasper did that nice diva Tedward zine. You know, it's not a lot of work, but it's just a lovely little thing to have on the table, a little limited edition thing. You know. This is making me want to do like uh, everything like this now instead of the 
mix in. Yeah. Yeah. Especially if, like, you know, I like to, like, paint a little something on the cover or, like, you know, a little with my stickers I used to put on stuff. It's just stamps and stickers. It's nice to make, you know, make them a bit special. Print them up all crappy in consumer productions, but zhuzh it up a bit. Yeah, if we went really hardcore, we could make another zine by the end of the week and print it here. We could make like an eight page weird thing, you know. It's like, why not? <laughs> why not? I do have other stuff to do, I suppose. What are we doing now? What are, we're done with this. What are, what are you, I guess you're doing the colouring and I'm, i got to draw this yeah, I epilogue strip. Do but... the end of victory squad for the Frenchies. But you're not doing that. February for that. Yeah, I mean, you can't do that till January. Are you going to do the colouring and victory squad at the same time? No, I'm going to write it at night. Yeah, yeah well, that's a good idea. And then what? Are you going to do goiter ads? Yeah. yeah. Just, just a victory squad exclusive. You've got to just do shorts as well. Come on. Yeah, yeah. How many are we going through here? We've got about... 15 or something, I'm getting that. Yeah, this is, this is a, this is lovely doing DIY like this. Yeah, missed yeah. it, really missed it. I spent so much time uh, in copy shops and yes. Yeah, so much of my, my youth spent doing this. It's lovely. And lots of flashbacks. Like, uh, me and Carl used to spend like six hours in, the, in his offices doing it. And me and Grant, and it's sticky for like, again like five or six hours just all day. Pe other people would come in. When, when do you think you'll be off the copy? I'm like, never. You may as well leave. <laughs> Oh, I just need to print five copies or something. Oh, well, we're printing thousands today. So Your work will understand. Yeah. Your presentation. Yeah, get out of here. Now we do our staples. It's not too shabby. Might have to buy some more. I'm sure they sell staples here. Or I might have to go back to staples. They've got the, their bogey out in the market. No one else can sell staples, it's in our name. Ah, oh, man, well, I'm glad we've managed to pull it off. It's got the worries. Me too. It's really nice to have this. Yeah, no, we can relax now. It looks like the Jones books are shipping. Uh, we should get them in time by Friday, hopefully. And uh, yes, it's feckin' Tuesday. They're, they're, they're shipping today. Yeah, they said in the email. Yeah, we're going to be cutting it close, but at least there's mail on Saturday here, like in Australia. You don't have mail on Saturday in the UK, do you? I don't think so. In Australia, it's just Monday to Friday. Like the idea of getting mail on Saturday is so luxurious to me. It still is. Like I can check the mailbox on a Saturday. Ooh. You used to get the milkman coming around. No, never, never had the milkman. My, my mother did in like the 60s, 70s and stuff in Tasmania. But no, I never had the milkman. Did you? And then you leave the empty mouth. It's crazy. Yeah, well, I think about stuff like that. I feel like I grew up in the 60s. Yeah, well, basically, all in the little islands that we came from. Yeah. Can't imagine the main man having an open as long as they're on the No, probably not. Uh, if you're in Manchester, I'm sure you were getting your, your proper cartons down at the... Uh, probably. Like, yeah. Or is it paper out? I don't think... Oh, well, maybe. I don't know. Is the machine say anything? Uh, Let me have a look. This doesn't feel like 30. Hang on. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think it might be actually here. Yeah. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yeah, that's that's thirty. One, two, three. Yep, yep. All right, let's, let's set it up and do another thirty. All right. Do you want to get it set up? Uh, put a load more paper in, I guess, and uh, run another thirty. That's the that's the bad paper. It's the thin paper. Oh yeah. That's our good shit. I'll start trimming these. Uh, these these feckers here. All right. Let's get just some trimming. Let's get some hot trim. All right. Here we go. Here we go. What's that? I was wondering if I should get more in. Put as much as you can. It's up to the fill line. Oh, trimming is so satisfying. Oh, ho, ho. Nicely, nicely. Need a car. Oh, again, yep. No worries. Yeah, I'm definitely going to make some more stuff over here. Yeah, 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 I could, I could do that here. Oh, the trimming is a problem. I don't like having that little bit of extra paper coming out. I don't know. I want to start doing stuff for tan again, but... His price has ever gone up, and there's the courier stuff. And yeah, it does have, you know, uh, courier it to the warehouse and get it sent. Yeah, I hope people appreciate all the hard work we've been doing, Josh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope they turn up to permanent damage if they're in the LA area on Sunday and throw their money at us. I am frustrated by that $5 uh, entry fee. Yeah, me too. So, you know. Yeah, you know, it's, it's a bit of a heft. It's money that people could be spending on product from the artists. Oh, that's half of one of these things. <laughs> Yeah, I hope it's not just paying the bands. I mean, I don't know why Keenan's charging. If it's paying for all those bands, then it's like, mm. <laughs> come on. <laughs> it's a comic show. Is it going? Still. Yeah. Yeah, all yeah no, they've got some good DJs here down at the, uh, down at the Staples. I'm assuming there's a guy at the back like doing live DJing. Like, it's probably not just a tape. I hope not. Go. I remember when I worked at Black's, the camping store in London. Uh, we just had to listen to this cassette. They, they, this corporate was sending these cassettes, and it was all cover songs. It was like Teenage Dirtbag by Wheatus, but like a cover version. And it was an absolute nightmare. Like. Just drove you mental. Yeah, they've got real songs here. These are the original artists. They must be paying through the nose for that. What's going on? Have, have you had 
you fetch it up. What is it fat? What's happening? What's going on? You're putting the sheets out of order there, Josh. What you done? Yeah, we're coming to start. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. See, show me, uh, that's right. I think it's right. We've got one out of order now. Center is my spread. That's oh, the center. Yeah. Okay. Fix those. Yeah. I'll, I'll get these. I missed the uh, two-page spread that was the end. That tricked you. two here that I can't figure out. I'm just going to put them aside over there and we'll figure them out at the end. Yeah. Oh, chaos. Down. This live stream is boring now. We're just trimming books and you know, trimming. Josh is handling that, and uh, yeah, we'll see you on uh, Sunday at permanent damage. I guess yeah, Josh, you're going to see people at Sunday on permanent damage. Sunday permanent damage. Sunday permanent damage. Sunday, permanent damage. Uh, we'll be there. I'll be there 12 to 5. We'll be flipping books. We got this. We got New Werewolf Jones. We got backlist stuff. We got Power Wash. We got all sorts of stuff. All right. Nate and Jasper, Johnny Ryan. Yeah, Nate and Jasper, Johnny Ryan. That's right. Yeah, what's that? Oh, that's going to cancel. Yeah, Diana Highfish will be there. Johnny Ryan, a uh, bunch of bunch of pricks. It's going to be amazing. If you if you're in the Los Angeles area, you be you've got to come down. All right, bye.